Hey there, it's Blue Milk Drinker. So recently I decided I was going to get into opening Yu-Gi-Oh cards, get more back into Yu-Gi-Oh. I've been playing Master Duel or whatever on the phone for a while and the PS5. But I want to get back into physical cards. And as soon as I get my dual disc out of storage, we're going to have a wild time. But I went on eBay and I saw a listing for some cards. And I thought I would get them. They don't really look that legit. They look fake and counterfeit, but I just wanted to, you know, get your guys' opinion of them. Alright, so we start off. 0283. This back looks totally fake. I have never seen cars that look like that before. We're going to give this an open. Let's see. Oh, they taped it, too. Alright, so we got this back. It's all in Japanese. It says 1999, made in Japan. It looks like some sort of field spell or something. I can't quite make it out. This is not what Yu-Gi-Oh cards are supposed to look like. What is this? There's a, the turtley dragon looking one. That's like the weird eyeball one I think Pegasus uses. There's another dragon. There's a chimera. See, I don't recognize most of this at all. I don't think this is legitimate Yu-Gi-Oh. Because, like, where's the pendulum? Where's the XYZ? You know? Like, there are all some weird-looking effect monsters I've never seen before. Hold on. Since when was Yu-Gi a card? Since when was either Yu-Gi a card? Or Joey? Or Seto? What are you doing with green hair? All right, clearly, I got, who are you? Ain't no one seen this card before. All right, click, oh, here we go, Curse of Dragon. All right, now we're getting into some cards I know. So, yeah, um... Very clearly fake, counterfeit, flame swordsman. Actually kind of looks pretty cool. So, um, yeah, I spent like 20, 20 bucks for 94 of these. I think I uh, kind of got robbed there. Let me know what you think.